one of the essential elements of care for people with complex needs are care plans. And the best ones start with a really thorough assessment of an individual's medical, social, and functional needs so that that can serve as a foundation for setting individualized goals and preferences with the patient and in some cases with their family members as well. I think it's also worth noting that these are living, breathing documents, and there should be ongoing review um, with the patient and family to monitor for effectiveness, but also to address any changes to the, the patient status. Another element of care for people with complex needs are interprofessional care teams. So some of the best models that we see have really flexible and adaptable teams that include a number of professions as well as specialties um, and can meet the needs of the, the patient as they're going in and out of the, the healthcare system. That said, it's really critical that these teams do have one key point of contact that the person can interact with um, and can help to coordinate the overall, um, the overall plan of care. Finally, it's critical that the person themselves is viewed as a really key member of the care team. People with complex needs are a heterogeneous population, and there's a number of segments that fall underneath that categorization. However, they're bound by the fact that the current health systems are not meeting their needs. Um, these are just a few elements of care that do lead to better care for people with complex needs. Mm -hmm.